Good afternoon. Thank you for stopping by Healing Conversations with Z. I'm Zuri BB. Yes, I have been gone for a while. Your girl's been going through some things. Um, I'm coming out on the other side of it. Part of my healing and part of my inner child dealings. Um, and it's funny because I just did another video and I didn't have no problems. But the minute I picked up these cards right here, all three cards, these decks, I start shuffling them, I start itching. Something in the message here. I don't know what's going on. I wasn't itching with the other cards. Now all of a sudden I'm itching. I'm trying to be distracted. It's like no message. They don't want the message out. I'll reshuffle again. Because I know some people think, oh, she's picking cards. No, I'm not picking no cards. I don't do that kind of stuff. But, um, yeah, I'm glad to be back. I didn't say that before. I am so glad to be back. Um, I've learned a lot about myself while going through this this issue, this tower moment that the divine put, you know. I wasn't ignoring the issue and evading it. I just didn't know how to effectively deal with it. And so they made it a point where I had no choice but to figure it out. And I figured it out. But um, I'm on the other side of it. Um, I'm stronger for it, wiser for it. More appreciative. I'm grateful for it. I know how to deal with that now. That issue. Um, and let me say this. Because I didn't say it on the other end. It didn't have nothing to do with Divine Masculine. Me and him, we cool. We on good terms. I mean, Divine Masculine and I love him. I love him. He didn't even know really know what was going on with me. He just was there for me. And that's all I needed. You know, a lot of people think, oh, you need him to be, you know, I want him to know. Just having somebody there to be, you know, be there. You know. But anyway, um, I need to clear. I want to make sure I clarify that. Me and Divine Masculine are not feuding. We ain't fighting. We ain't got no drama. We ain't got, you know, I'm doing my thing. I do what I need to do and he's doing what he needs to do. And, um... No, it is what it is. I don't know nothing about no comics, so I don't even, in my mind, I'm done with that. Whatever is going on, those are his lessons that he has to deal with. My issue, you know, when I was, whatever it was that I was dealing with, it could have been, a, that could have been my karmic situation. I didn't even think about it like that. I'm saying karmic. Maybe that was my karmic situation. So I had to deal with my karmic my karmic situation i'd rather put it that way it is what it is um person place or thing it wasn't a person i can tell you that much um but um the situation has you know it's just about done it's it's resolved enough where i don't have to um i can come back and be clear and give you all messages now um if I'm dealing with something so bad where I, you know, is really bad, I'm going to back away and take care of myself. Self-healing is always first. I had to take care of myself. Because if I'm trying to heal y'all and I'm struggling, it's not going to be a good message. Not at all. I know that for a fact. Um, so, just so that you all understand. I didn't disappear because I just didn't want to be here. I had some things I needed to deal with. Um, this reading is going to be what spirit wants you to know. And, um, we'll see. Apparently spirit wants you to know that, I kid you not, the minute I started sh pre-shuffling the cards before I turned on the camera, um, I started itching. I mean, my legs start itching, my, um, my thighs start itching. It was to the point where it was a distraction where I had to stop. You know, and that to me is a warning. Not a bad warning, but somebody doesn't want some something doesn't want to be out. There's some something is coming. Um, you know, whenever you're distracted like that, there's something important that needs to be said. Because you're only distracted from giving something to someone who may need it. So um 
I want to thank the people who were. I still had people subscribing while I was gone. Thank you all for subscribing. The ones that um, are still here. Um, thank you for coming by. Thank you for the comments. I appreciate that. Um, I see now um, I'm going to be able to at least post one video a day. Maybe more, but it you know it's going to be at least one. And so that's that's the least I can do. I probably it's going to be more. I'm talking, I'm just talking crazy, but I want to at least do um, one video a day. Um, I had to remember how to do shuffle these cards, set this up. This is the um, what spirit wants you to know spread. Um, let's do that. Yeah, I'll pull it up. All right. Here we go. Um, spirit. I've already done my early morning spirit protection, but I'll ask that spirit continue to protect me and my, um, um, subscribers and the people who come to my channel to watch, please um, protect them while they uh, watch my readings. Protect them as they go about their ways. If they are, if they don't mean me any good, keep them away from my channel. Burn them away with the white, with the red flame. To have them go elsewhere. I only want the clear, pure light. Lord, as I give this message, let it be of you, divine Lord. Let it be of you, not of myself. I take my ego out of it. Um, this message is to help people on their journey. And um, so be it. Here we go. All right. First card is where you are right now, whoever's watching. Feline. Let's see what that says. I'm going to read them all. Because it's like I said, I have not been on here in a while. Feline. I'll read it all because there's just a lot going on here. Perhaps it feels as though nothing is happening for you at the moment. Life does have its lows and downtime. The feline card has come to let you know that in just a short time, the action is going to kick in. Get ready for it. Oh, get ready. I'm going to stop. Something's about to happen. Remember I told you I started itching? There is something about to happen. Quickly. Right now. Not right now, but literally there is something coming in your life. That's going to happen like, like like you're going to be one minute, nothing going on. And then the next minute, everything is going to be happening all at once. So whatever you've been working on, if you think nothing's happening with it, all of a sudden your business or whatever is going to go. Zoop is going to be overwhelming. Not in a bad way. It's just going to be from si dead silence to constant movement. Um, you could also be... They're saying that you might need to go have a massage. Somebody need to have some me time. Um, what else? Yeah, pretty much that's what this is. This is, you know how cats are. They, they relax, you know, and then all of a sudden they jump around. That's what this card is saying. So get ready. You got something. That's getting ready to happen in your life in a big way. All right. So let's see what this next card is. What do you have to overcome? Assistance. Somebody's getting some help from up above because that looks like a spaceship to me. There are the wings. There's the ship. There are the waves, the energy waves that's... um. Pulling you across. But let's see.
somebody oh you're gonna get some help whatever whatever it is that you're saying that's not happening right here you're gonna get some help with it isn't that cool you're gonna get some help so get ready um it's going to like i said is you know things are at a standstill and then all of a sudden you're going to you're going to be moving and that's what this card is saying you're going to be going from zero to 60 pretty soon that's what this is and it's going to be from the divine because that's a spaceship yeah and those are waves energy waves and i see something green green or yellow that's like the heart so apparently this is done they're coming to help you because it's going to be love and look at this i didn't even look at the colors here you got a lot of green and so healing green and yellow heart purple I don't know all, I don't remember all the colors of the chakras but they're here in this card for sure but I see a lot of the main thing is yellow and green so it's going to be a lot of yellow a lot of healing and there's going to be a lot of love because whoever's coming to help you is because they love you it's pretty cool all right and what's happening at a soul level vibration you are attract you 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 have a certain vibration that's that you're exuding and that you're attracting and i think I, i'm a re i'm reading the cards but i i almost stopped reading doing these cards but i like looking at it let me see yeah this is this is you right now you are by you are attracting your vibration you, you you're very high vibe right now and whatever that high vibe is that's what's attracting this help because your vibration is so high it is so high that you're going to get help and i'm a i'm going to actually talk about this about myself just this part right here because this is deep whatever i was going through for a minute i felt like this like nothing was happening i was just dealing with an issue and i was like how what how am i going to deal with this how, you know what what's going on with this and, and then <clears throat> i kid you not out of the blue i got assistance and i don't mean just from i got a lot of assistance it was stuff that i didn't ask for and I think I got the assistance because my vibe was so high. And that the, um, the divine saw that I was using my gifts. And they decided to send it to me because my vibe, you know, was so high. This is interesting. I have not picked up these cards in a while. And that's interesting how this can come out like this. Let me see what's going on. What's happening on the physical level? Recognition. Yep, you're getting the assistance you're, because the divine recognizes that you are doing you are doing what you're supposed to do. You're healing yourself. You're getting healed. You're doing the things you're supposed to do. Um, wow, I'm gonna I'm not gonna I'm I'm gonna put this down. Put this book down. You are getting the help because your vibe is high. And that the divine recognizes you and recognizes that you need the help, that you are deserving of it. You are very deserving of this help. Oh, what's this? I'll have to see what number five says. And what do you do, need to do to embrace this help? Pray. Look at that. Ain't that about nothing? You need to pray. This is probably for me. Because like I said, I'm telling you, I was going through some some mental stuff. It was interesting. So some, you know, somebody else may be going through this as well. And what's the outcome? Love. I told you. 
told you you were getting that help, you got that assistance because you somebody loves you. They coming down to help you. So, yeah. Don't think just because you don't see things happening right now and it might be slow for you right now, don't give up because help assistance is on the way. Keep your vibe high. Keep it high. Keep your vibe high. Let me put let me let me go back up. Just you know, you, you might be relaxing like a cat right now. And even though you don't think anything's happening, in a minute it's gonna assistance is gonna come. It's gonna come out of nowhere. And it's because you've kept your vibe high. Your vibration, you know, your vibration attracts or detracts. And so you're gonna get something. Because your vibration is high. You need to make sure you keep it high. Because as long as you keep it high and positive, the good help, protection, assistance that you need, they'll recognize who you are. They'll recognize you from your vibration. Your vibration will give you... It's like putting out an SOS or a signal. And um, some, you know, the people that look for the signals, they'll know how to find you. That's how it works with the divine. And, you know, that's with the prayers. You know, he'll recognize you too because of your, your vibration and your prayers. And they'll recognize you because they love you. They'll love you. They'll give you the desires of your heart. I almost don't even want to pull a clarifier, but I'm going to do it. Let's see. I have to look at the book for these because I don't, I don't know these symbols yet. I don't know, um, like I said, I had, I started to recognize them and then I had my tower moment, you know, my thing going on and I had to stop. All right, we got, oh, we got, hmm, two cards, do it this way. All right, so, a 10, so there's going to be some type of ending so something can be restarted. And that is gentleness. You are an intricate being that is unique and diverse in your own special way. Spirit asks that you be gentle with yourself and accept the delicate nature of who you are. The spiraling energy is here to remind you that there is a great power and strength in your softness and it is here to assist you in healing on all levels. It is also here to remind you that you are a divine being of light who is as deserving as any other human being on earth. Smile and recognize your own authenticity and beauty in all your glory. Look at that recognition. Your vibration. Look at that. I'm telling you. Can't make this stuff up. Here we go. Okay, so let's look in the other one. Um, 15. I think I've seen this card before. Revelations. There is, there are new beginnings ahead. The veil is being lifted to reveal something new that was previously not available to you. In one way, this can relate to a new environment, such as uh, moving to a new location or changing jobs. However, it can also denote the revealing a new perspective, that what you previously held as truth was only a portion of the whole. All is being revealed to you now. From here, you can operate with a new view, seeing things as they really are. Look at that. Look at that. When you pray... You know, you can see, you know, prayers will open up a different view. You know, the assistance that you receive will give you a different view. Love will give you a different view. Your vibration will give you a different view of what you previously thought you were looking at. Interesting. Let's see. 36. Revealed. 
and there's a lot of things being revealed this is a gorgeous card did you know how beautiful you truly are it is time to stop hiding from the world the universe is calling you you have so much to offer so much to give this card is a reminder for you to see who and what you truly are you are a part of the one you are beautiful and perfect in every way when you hide yourself you are withholding not only your energy but your love love for yourself and love for others embrace yourself and all your quirks we all have them let yourself be free let yourself shine okay this is just too eerie for this message this message has to be for me um I was told I've been I'm constantly being told not to hide quit hiding and I used to show my face on my videos and then I stopped showing my face on my videos and a while back I said well I'm going to start showing my face on my videos and as soon as I said that I had the tower moment and all this other stuff going on so this is I probably in the near future because I'm still trying to figure out the the best setup for me I need I look I'm in one part of my house where i'm doing things but i may have to move into another environment where i can set the camera up where i can see you all and you can see me because i am a real person um if you look at my old videos that's i do look like that on the old videos so um i'm gonna take this message for me as well i have not picked up my card since i was going through my um karmic or dark tower or tower moment um and like i said i am on the other side of it and I, this is my first time picking these cards and my hands are even itching so apparently this is for me this message is for me as well um so i'm hoping that you all got something from this message like i did if you feel like you um saw something different please comment we here to talk and have a conversation. I, I have no problem learning from you all as well. Well, let me tell you. You can tell me what you've been going through. You know, we are here to help one another. Uh, we are not just here to be by ourselves. Um, like I said on the other channel, I mean other channel, uh, on the other video, I'm going to um, begin talking, um, talking about other people. I know for sure um, I bought my package the inner child package um from jupiter 1111 she does chakra clearing um that's and uh who else do i watch um man see i can't oh uh i'm in a couple of groups um discord i'll have to find out how i can share that information and then I'm also going to, later on this month, I'm going to join a, another group for Twin Flames eSpot. Um, when I get more information on how I can do all that, I will post them in my videos. Um, and there are other people that I watch as well. But those are the three. And actually, no, there is another one. And that's um, who's package that I purchased. Um, Sophia Childs twin flame community um i she she's she's the real deal but anyway um let me stop right there because where am i at on this video 24 minutes okay let's shut it down i'm trying you know i will talk sometimes really long but since this is my first day back and i got some other videos i need to post i don't want to hold you all long thank you for stopping by healing conversations and I will see you soon. Peace.